Okay, hi, I'm back. And I have a question from Georgia Wint. And she says, Do we comprehend outside of the game that our all that is is a part of another all that is and so on? Infinite, like the Russian dolls. Yes, we do. We totally understand that. And we not only understand that, but it's no big deal. It's like, yeah, so? Here it's a big deal, because we have linear time space, and you're taught that you're little and you're nothing. But on the other side, we're very aware that we're gods. We're very aware of how this whole process works, and how we play and create and move on and all of that stuff. We're very aware of it. Yeah, it's and it's no big deal at all. And then the next question was, what if a god outside this game doesn't want to exist anymore? Well, if... For some reason, uh, a consciousness, a being, a god, decided that they wanted to lose all of their experience or take all that experience and, and just put it arbitrarily amongst the all that is, not as a collection that belongs with you, but just, yeah, like that. Uh, sure, they could do that. I have never seen that done. I don't remember it done. I don't know why it would be done. I would see no purpose in it. But could it be done? Certainly everything can be done. Yeah. I guess I could have typed that, or maybe I did whenever I answered this. Um, thank you very much, Georgia, for your song. Uh, Georgia sent me an email with a song that she taped, which is ironic, and I just was laughing so hard. Stephanie and I were both laughing so hard because she... Uh, Georgia obviously loves rhythm and blues, or jazz and blues, rather. And so she did a 30-song uh, beautiful voice um, like Billie Holiday. She has a voice like Billie Holiday, I think. That's what it reminds me of. And she sent me a song that was called Gloomy. And it's about Gloomy Sunday. And I was just rolling. I went, the person on the Internet that tells you to be happier and happier. And she does a song and sends it to me. And it's called Gloomy, which I loved. I thought it was hilarious. But um, I would like her to do, I would like for you to do me a little bit happier song, though, because you have a beautiful voice. And I do love, love her voice. She's got a beautiful voice. If she does me another song, maybe I can get her to give permission, and I'll, uh, I'll play it on one of the videos for you. Uh, because she really does have a beautiful voice. So thank you very much for sending that to me, uh, Georgia, it was lovely, lovely of you, love that, love that when you guys share with me your art, and dance, and, and singing, and didn't you say you like to dance too, you should sing and dance for, for me, and do a video of singing and dancing, okay, so, oh, and she says something about, she loves my dark, husky, gruff voice, just to let you know, I didn't used to have a voice like this. This is what happens whenever they put a, an a air tube down your throat for 30 days. <laughs> you wake up and they take it out and you have a different voice. I used to be able to sing too. I can't sing anymore uh, because it, my voice got messed up because of it. So, but my voice and I can't, ho I can't holler very loud either. So, there was a lot of changes. Whenever I woke up, my voice was one of them, interestingly enough. So, I'm glad that you like my voice, though. I appreciate that. It's very, very sweet. Okay, that's it for this one. I know this one's pretty short, but oh well. That's the way it is. Thank you guys for watching my video. Hope you give me a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't. Uh, thank you to all my PayPal people and Patreon uh, people. Thank you for everybody who who does sessions with me. I really appreciate it. Huge hugs, guys, and I'll see you guys later. Bye now.